Romans that they had to be born again, but certainly he was not talking about the Jewish nation. All these things was in his mind and his thoughts. Yes, surely his birth was better, you know, better than uh, that of the Gentiles or the Samaritan. He thought put it on 88.1. We have people today, they it's a good show that their salvation 88.1. I like it, she's funny than the ones that still laying on the street that have not accepted Christ. We're no better, we just say, but God still loved that person laying on the street, He loved them that are. Uh, uh, caught up in addictions. He loved them who continue to be rebellious. Oh, he loved them. Yes, indeed. Oh, we begin to think we are better. Oh, we are saved. But we are, we have that sinful nature just like anybody else and we are subject to fall at any given time. But what, what has us secure is the blood of Jesus Christ. Yes, the blood of Jesus Christ. Nicodemus as I said, was a well-educated man, but he didn't understand the basics of salvation. Jesus was patient with him. Oh, yes, he was. Let me tell you what else Jesus went on in that chapter to tell Nicodemus. He said, listen, for God so loved the world. You see, he didn't say for God so loved the Jews. He said God so loved the world uh, that he gave his one and only son that whosoever believe in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Yes, not only the Jews, but the whole world. You too, Nicodemus.